coup de caméra, a lot of cameras for the star of the Irish national stud, invincible spirit, a horse of a lifetime, a stallion of a lifetime, and I'm the best in the world. And we're here with Patrick again. Patrick, uh, let's talk about this star. What does it mean for the Irish national stud to have such a sire? I suppose it's just a true honour to have a horse as good as him. Uh, he's a superstar, a horse of a lifetime, really. I suppose we've had horses, Hanover, Indian Ridge, and you always think that maybe that's the best horse that you ever have. But I think that um, Invincible Spirit has really gone on to that next level and is going to be a horse that lives on in pedigrees um, well past his lifetime, um, and um, he'll be lived on. He'll, his memory will live on through that. But um, for the time being, he's excelling. He's still the main man, um, still the star of the show. He had his first British Classic winner this year um, in Magna Grecia. So he's still firing on all cylinders. He's got a hundred mares in foal this year. So he himself is just a superstar that um, is always is in bonus territory now. But a horse that we we cherish and we feel privileged to have a horse of his caliber on the farm. Invincible Spirit, uh, un honneur de s'occuper d'un cheval comme ça, un, un cheval qui n'a plus rien à prouver. Maintenant, comme nous dit Patrick, c'est un peu du bonus. Il a fait son premier gagnant de classique anglais, les 2000 Guinées, cette année avec Magna Grecia, qui est désormais étalon à Coolmorston. Uh, so, you talk about a new stallion, Patrick, Magna Grecia. Uh, How can you describe the influence of Invincible Spirit on the sire uh, park? Uh, you know, all the sires in England, Ireland, even maybe in France. Invincible Spirit is very looked as a sire of sire. Uh, how do you describe it? Why? Um, I suppose Green Desert has been a huge influence. Um, Green Desert's genes to pass that on to the stock, but um, I suppose to go to the level that he's gone on to is, is substantial. Um, and his sons have just continuously done it now. And Kingman is one of the leading sires in England. You've got I'm Invincible. And from a stint, small stint in Australia, he left I'm Invincible, who is champion sire out there. Um, Cable Bay is leading first season sire in England. So with all of those factors in consideration, all of his sons that go to stud now are, are sought after and could be the next champion based on that. So with the likes of Shalar, with the likes of National Defence, with the likes of Profitable all coming through and there's some, some even with McNagrisha going to stud now, there's another one, another one, another one on the on the conveyor belt line of potential champion sires. Invincible Spirit, un étalon qui s'affirme de plus en plus comme père de père. En France, on a Chala, ici ils ont Cable Bay en Angleterre, qui est étalon leader de première production. I am Invincible en Australie, c'est un cheval exceptionnel, bien sûr. And we can talk about the fresh news, a new addition to his roster of mares, Lawrence, the, the winner of the Prix de Diane in France by CUNY, a wonderful mare. Uh, how do you receive uh, this uh, star mare and for an quite an old stallion. It's a privilege to have mares like that years after year. No? Yeah, I mean, he doesn't know he's old. He's, uh, he, he looks fantastic um, and he's still firing the foal. I suppose it's a huge honor to, to get a mare as good as Lauren. She's a, she's a superstar um, and we look forward to, to the mating and we look forward to the foal. But um, I suppose it's, it's a fantastic mating, uh, a top class mare to a top class sire who's a proven sire, which will um, certainly give her exactly what they're looking for in a, a speed um, and physics it will suit her down to the ground I would have thought so it's just a, an exciting opportunity that, that we're delighted that John Dance has given us to cover her in her first season um, I suppose it's a sign of how talented he is and even though at 23 that he is still the main man um, and he will be for some time Thank you Patrick and let's hope for another star season for Invincible Spirit. Invincible Spirit qui rencontrera Lorenz l'an prochain pour sa première saillie, la championne Lorenz gagnant du prix de Diane. La preuve que cet étalon est toujours au top et toujours l'un des meilleurs. Invincible Spirit, vous êtes face à l'un des étalons du top 5 mondial, messieurs, dames. Admirez-le bien, il ne sera pas éternel, mais son héritage le sera. <musique>